my gem babies. I'm just reading this for you guys. It's going to be a quick method for first half of April. So let's get into it. It is a general read. You already know the spiel. So it won't um, resonate with everyone. But let's see what messages we have for my gem babies. The messages you have for my Gemini's. I'm starting off with my deck, the Magical Goon Oracle deck. If you like it, cop it. The link will be in the comments, okay? What messages do you have for my Gemini's? Or first half of April. Yeah, already in April. Oh my gosh, I already see this year is just going to fly by. Crazy. What messages for my gems? Okay, clingy. Let's see what that is about. Some of you guys may be clinging on to a person, um, a situation. Thing that just doesn't what we're gonna see all right all right so it looks like you guys may be clinging on to a situation but you guys may need to explore other options or just explore in general in some area of your life um but there is definite success that will come in with you um just not clinging to one situation not just settling just for one thing there may be something that you don't want but you're settling and you're just clinging to it or maybe situation that the universe is telling you hey you're really clinging on to this but this is there's something better for you so explore and that could bring you a lot of success okay gems was also picking up the energy of progress success ahead um the bottom here we have 777 that just came out for a Taurus jackpot okay so there's definitely the energy of success around you guys at this time so be open to options explore don't just cling on to one scenario one situation one thing okay explore and um, that is so Gemini to be able to ex explore you guys are curious <laughs> you guys are intelligent so explore at this time. What messages do you have for my gems? We have fucking apologize. Seriously, just do it. So some of you gems may owe someone an apology. Hey, it is what it is sometimes. All right. What messages do you have for my Gemini's? We have detox it says drink a smoothie unfriend that asshole and throw some shit out what messages for my gems what messages for my gemini Drop the fucking ego. This may go hand in hand with owing someone an apology. It says vulnerability is hot as fuck. All right. Let's get into the ascending life oracle for my gems. What messages do you have? My Gemini's. All right, so we have sad news, disappointing message, not what you wanted to hear, something not going in your favor, inconvenient truth. So, again, some of you guys may owe someone an apology. Also, for others, um, something that you're clinging on to just may not go in the way that you wanted it to go. Um, there may be... A disappointment or sad news or you know just a little let down around that situation that you're clinging to and that may be why you need to explore other options and just explore in general is 
that will bring in success. That bad, that sad news or the little disappointment is not the, how do they say it? End all be all. Trust me, it's not. What else for my Gemini's? Something else flip over too. Let's see. Not that I can see. All right, so we have the world. So we have, for some of you guys, a definite completion. Okay. Reaching a major milestone. This is falling right under success. An achievement. Maybe an end of a journey, end of a chapter, and into you know, another chapter that allows you to explore things that really align with you and that you really enjoy. What else for my Gemini? All right, we got two here. This one came out first. So we have good health and we have soulmates. Some of you guys may need to detox or really pay attention to um, your body balance, you know, that um, work-life balance, balance that, um, you know, drink some smoothies, eat some green shit, really take care of yourself at this time so you can continue to, you know, move forward, charged up and be successful. Uh, for some of you guys, there may be some... A soulmate coming in some of you guys <laughs> you may have um, said something to a soulmate or a partner that just did not sit right with them or you may owe them an apology some of you guys may be clinging on to a person okay that you think is a soulmate here hold on oh, okay. so we have the unseen and boundaries so for a lot of you guys the divine is working behind the scenes for you there may be some boundaries that need to be put in place okay there are some blessings that are coming in some of you guys you may have received some sad news that has you not feeling so optimistic but there are some blessings that you don't see magic happening behind the scenes okay that is in love and it looks like also around work and career but there are some definite boundaries in some area of your life that needs to be put up um, with a situation or a person okay some of you guys may be called to stand your ground um, don't work out of or come from your ego at this time, okay? But definitely put up your boundaries. Whatever you do, stay true to yourself at this time, no matter what situation comes up. And maybe someone that owes you an apology. And you may need to stand your ground and be like, hey, listen, I was really fucked up. And put some boundaries down so that bullshit does not repeat itself again okay anger yeah right now try not to um work from the ego okay like some of you guys may feel like you have been wronged in a situation there may have been arguments disagreement um you know clash of egos tempers flying um right now you may feel like you are angry at somebody and you're just holding on to the situation or this argument, this replay of something that may happen, may have happened with maybe a soulmate. Um, a soulmate, it can be, <laughs> it can be, you know, a family member. It could be um, any kind of connection. Um, a mother, a father, you know. 
but don't work from the ego be the bigger person even if they're working or coming from from the ego you know tell me more for my job like this is gonna be a quick reading but lord all right creativity so some of you guys you may need to explore things that um, make you happy bring you joy that um, give you a creative spark okay you need to embrace and actually take um, go full force with any new creative ideas or projects that you have express yourself projects that allow you to express yourself creatively creatively you know what i mean <laughs> at this time um a lot of you guys what will bring in success is um following your creative instincts when it comes to projects work especially for my entrepreneurs okay leadership so high influence in business some of you guys will be step stepping into a leadership role um like i said do not settle know your value and your worth at this time don't work from the ego use logic over emotion okay even if somebody's acting a damn ass i feel like i need to pull a couple more from the magical going deck if you like it link will be in the comments Dang, gems. Y'all reading gonna be a little bit longer. All right, we have guidance. Explore and guidance. So there will be some guidance coming in for you guys. Um, it's like the universe, your ancestors, whomever is trying to guide you in the right direction, even if you are clinging on to something. <laughs> that just needs to be detoxed or let go of, okay? So allow them to guide you. Pay attention to the signs, be open. What we got here? Stay plotting. So there may have been someone around you who is just plotting, um, manipulative. It's like, they always just plotting and thinking about how they can get ahead, just selfish. Some of you guys, um, with this disappointing news, you may need to sit, contemplate, and strategize. Just pay my bills. Yeah. You guys are at this point. <laughs> you know, you may have um, some creative projects going on or... You just, you just like, listen, I just need to get the bills paid. I just need this shit to pay my motherfucking bills, okay? And then we have fake news. Progress ahead. This is what I was picking up um, on in the pre-shuffle. So, let's pull from the Moonology deck from our gems yeah there may be a manipula manipulator a liar always plotting I want some fake ass news fake ass story about something I don't know what messages do you have for my gems whatever you're working on if it's a creative project or whatever even if some disappointing news comes in hold your vision okay you have to hold your vision at this time persevere through the bottom we have a personal issue reaches resolution but let me read from hold your vision real quick right to the page all right hold your vision there are two main possibilities with this card the first is that you need to stand firm in whatever situation you're in 
Yep, definitely you need to stand your ground, okay? The second, very different. Interpretation is that something is stuck that could well be interfering to the situation you're asking about. If that's the case, have a think about what you can do to grieve the will so that events move forward. Are you being stubborn? <laughs> if so, that's great because if you really want things to change, there's a solution. Stop digging your hill. Stop digging your heels in. Be the one to break a deadlock. With two interpretations for this card, it's up to you to decide what's going on and which meaning applies to you. This offers up a chance for some self-reflection. So, so another meaning for this card is yes. Just say the word a lot and see how it feels. Yes. Additional meaning Staying power, faith, or patience are needed. Someone needs to back down. Another meaning, avoid stagnation. Or a personal or professional relationship will be enduring. All right, we're going to pull some fortune cookie messages for my junk, and then we're going to wrap this up. Yeah, for some of you guys progress ahead what we got psychopath you guys are dealing with somebody who is just unstable just an asshole um you know work from their ego not control of their emotions um luck is on the way so definitely progress all right what messages for my job that popped out here we have reinvent yourself at the bottom a transformation is taking place enjoy a new lease on life then we have three here so we have property travel and luck a property purchase for sale or sale for many but heed security concerns in any transaction okay travel long distance communication will open up your life Exciting experiences for singles and career advancements for others. Beautiful. Progress ahead. Success. Okay. Luck. A sudden change of luck is likely. Things are working in your favor. Excellent time for networking. All right. All right, my gems. So, also, you already know. Quick plug. I know you gems love to get to the bag. So, spiritual ritual bath. Also can be used as a floor wash for your business or your home to attract that abundance. You got our oils because you got the bag, boo. Okay. And if you need any of your citrine, you know, citrine crystal bracelets, which is good for confidence, optimism, necklaces, whatever, you know, all the cute shit, all the shit you need. Okay. Link is going to be in the comments. All right, be sure to follow and comment and like for your girl. And I will see you guys in the next video. Love you, gems. Bye.